Danny's checking out the new bunny. What do you think, Danny? Hmm? She messy, huh? Look at the mess. Any good ideas for names? I'm thinking lavender or maybe cocoa. Danny actually got inside. She she jumped out and he actually was in her got in her cage when I looked over he's in there. I'm like, "What are you doing, Danny?" He's been reaching through with his paw to touch her. That's what I was trying to get on camera, but of course, once I get the camera out, he stops. Look at the way he's looking at her though. With his little head tilted. He's so cute. He's such a sweet cat. They're still babies, too. They're only eight months old. What you think, Danny? I don't know if you should go in there, huh? No. And she is not afraid of these cats one bit. My new bunny, she's a lion maned dwarf rabbit, I guess, is lion haired, lion maned, I'm not sure. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, <laughs> you are too cute. Be nice, Danny, be nice, don't hit her. It's okay to touch and sniff, but I don't want you hitting her. She's a nice bunny. Danny, don't do that. Danny. See, she's not even phased by it. She's got a litter box. This is just where she's going to have to sleep. She's not, not going to be kept in here at all times because it's pretty small. I didn't want the litter box in here, but she is messy. She is just making such a mess. And I have thus far seen her go to the bathroom in the litter box. The lady we got her from said that they like to eat while they're pooping. So I put some hay in there, Timothy hay, stuff that they like to eat, and alfalfa, and that mat she's sitting on is supposed to be for her to dig, tear up, and, you know, like, make a nest, because that's what they do in the wild. But yeah, this is my Mother's Day present. They bought me the rabbit, but then I had to spend almost $200 on getting supplies, so. Happy Mother's Day. Here, go spend all your money. Anyways, she's beautiful though, isn't she? What a darling little bunny. Don't worry. I will not let my animals hurt her. They're just curious. Our dogs too. Maisie's been chasing her in circles around the house. And the the, the bunny seems to be loving it. I think she thinks she's playing. Well, Maisie's playing too. She's not being mean. My bigger dog, Tulip, the big baby, she is just been out of shape. Up in my lap crying and whining because I think she thinks that she's going to be replaced or get less love or something. But we literally have seven animals now in this tiny house of ours. Danny, Danny, I'm watching you. You be good. Dan Dan, you gonna be a good boy? Yeah, look at this bedding. I didn't know. It came with the cage. Got a deal on the cage. It's supposed to come with the water bottle and dish and 
betting. So anyway, and a bunch of coupons, and anyways, and it was on sale, so I got this, they can be the better deal. I get home, and the water bottle's missing, these little clips on the side were missing, the dish was missing, you know, and that's the box, it said it's supposed to have all that stuff. It's a guinea pig, and, like, it says it's good for dwarf bunnies, which she's a dwarf bunny, so... And anyways, you know, she's she's going to get to run around quite a bit. You see how the door is open. She's been coming and going as she pleases. She's pretty smart for a baby. I think she's nine weeks old. And the lady we got her from had more baby bunnies. And the other ones were one month old. She brought one out. Oh my gosh. Never seen anything so cute. What are you doing? I don't know why you're rolling in it. And supposedly their litter box chain trained, so I really hope that they really are. Because I, like I said, I have not seen her. I've seen her get in it. And you can litter box train them because they sell litter boxes for them. So, I mean, that's a, that is a rabbit litter box. And, yeah, look how messy this bedding is. It's a stick into her. It's all over her face. Isn't she the cutest thing? I think I'm going to call her Lavender. But... If anybody's watching this video and has a cute name, I would love to hear it in the comments. We don't have many subscribers, but I don't know. Maybe I thought I thought Cinnabon was kind of cute. Bun Bun. Bun Bun. That's what I've been calling her. It's because I don't have a name for her. That's not... I, won't name her that, but I also liked Coco and Ginger, Willow, I have, I had a lot of, a lot of names, but the one, and Mocha, Latte, Nutmeg, Biscuit, all our other animals are pretty much named human names, and I want to name her a cute name, not, you know, not Alice or Danny or Dave, Grant. Grant was our, our beloved Persian cat that is passed on. Dave was our other cat that we had for four years that disappeared. So now these cats are stuck inside because of that. And we had a dog named Elvis. But our dogs are Maisie and Tulip. The cats Danny and Alice. Name her Hufflepuff. Hufflepuff. My husband thought of a really cute name, clever name. Dusty for Dust Bunny. Get it? I think that is so clever, but I don't know if I like the name Dusty. I mean, it is fitting, but I just I just don't know if I, I like it enough. Dusty. And that is adorable, Dust Bunny. <laughs> Alright, anyways, that's, that's my video for now. I'll keep an update. What's going on? I say bye, Danny. Yeah, Danny. Hi, Alice. 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 Oh, Danny wants to love up the camera.